There's less room for error given the fact that even though you guys are 12-0, if you slip up next week, you know, you don't, there's no guarantee you're going to make the playoff. Um, I'm not worried about you know, I'm slipping up. I'm worried about trying to beat them. You, you talk about fixing those errors. You know, how much of an emphasis was that already in, a lot, in the locker room, knowing what's ahead next week? Uh, we really weren't focused on next week. Hey, we was trying to get out of this game. So, uh, like I said, it's something we'll dial in on it tomorrow. Um, just really just fixing the mistakes that we had and we got to play better. At your time at Georgia, how have you seen that Georgia Tech program grow? I mean, they're bowl eligible, and, and you know, Brent Keaton has really turned this program around. Um, Coach Smart said it, you know what I'm saying, before we even played the guys that, you know what I'm saying, this might not be the same Georgia Tech team that you faced over the years. And, like, give credit, I give credit where credit is due. When those guys came out, they had some fire, they played like they wanted to win this game. Um, they, they had a great running game, you know what I'm saying? The quarterback was into it. Um, the guy made plays with his legs, um, com key, um, converted on fourth down plays. Man, those guys played, you know what I'm saying, great football in all aspects, and that's how it goes to them. What it seems like, why did it seem like Haynes King had so much success with his legs and you guys have had issues with defending mobile quarterbacks at times? I mean, it's, it's, it's hard to, you know what I'm saying, keep for a guy that, you know what I'm saying, you lock up, you, I won't say lock up, but you defend the passes mm -hmm. and then the guy takes off, you know what I'm saying, 15-yard game with his legs. I mean, that's hard to defend. Mm -hmm. And you see it day in and day out, even in, the, even in the pros, you know what I'm saying, like mobile quarterbacks are really taking over today's game. Mm -hmm. So really just... Um, we got to dial in on that, knowing that, you know what I'm saying, we're going to have a very mobile quarterback going forward in this next game. Um, and we got to uh, really just dial in the things that we need to fix. Um, I, like I said, I give credit where credit's due, but I'm not going to just sit here and act like we played the perfect game because we didn't. What's your excitement level going into the SEC championship game, knowing this is a goal you guys have to work each, toward each year and playing in that game and potentially obviously win. winning it? I want to be an SEC champion. Awesome. Thanks, Tom.